Uh, unbelievable. I think that uh, would end up summing up a big portion of what's going on. Um, you, you know, being up 12, 12-9 uh, 12 in set five and ended up allowing them back in. Um, you know, at that given point, you're supposed to shut the door and just uh, take care of the match. But um, I, I did an awful lot of praying during those last few points and just was, you know, please help us, please help us be with us now. And, uh, um, but they, they've put themselves in situations like that before all season. And this is the second time that they've gone to a full five set match. Um, these girls have definitely made a statement throughout the entire season. And uh, a credit uh, to them. They uh, have the um, determination to just stick like glue to each other and and make and produce. Norville's got those three big guns. Obviously. Yes. I guess what were we, I'll talk a question from you and Cassie. Just what were you guys able to do to neutralize them enough? Um, we, you know, we started out blocking the first set extremely well and really shut them down. And then we started to back off. We started tipping and was not staying aggressive. Set four, um, we really needed to make sure that we were pushing. Um, not literally pushing the ball, but we had to push ourselves. We needed to stay aggressive. And I think that made a big difference. When we were on the attack and kind of keeping them back on their heels, we were able to make the plays that we typically and that we have made the entire season. So um, going away from our game plan, yes. Getting back to where we were, where we needed to be for our game plan, definitely. Yeah, so you just talk about what they brought to the table up from Yeah, well, we definitely got down for a little bit, but that's the determination that we have to have, and we really brought it. This has been a dream of ours since we were little, and we are going to do anything to get there and bring it all home. None of you guys have played at State before, but that first set, you guys look like you had been here every year in high school. I mean. Were you nervous at all? Were there any jitters, or did you just come out to play? Came out to play. <laughs> 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 of course, there's a lot of excitement. You know, we've been dreaming of this forever, but. I think once we like saw and got on the floor, we felt really confident within each other, <laughs> with ourselves, and we knew we could do it. There were definitely butterflies, but. <laughs> <laughs> we might have gotten too confident in the next match, but. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is for any of you players. Um, I guess what's going through your mind when it does go from 12 7, 13 all, 14 all? Um, <laughs> how did it happen and how did you figure, take yourself out of it? Um, same as any point. You got to put all your effort, same amount of effort in each ball. You have to believe. You obviously believe in your teammates, believe in yourself, and you can get the job done. It's, I mean, those points are so crucial. It's definitely putting your trust in all your teammates. We knew we could do it. We just kept telling each other, we, we know we can do this. We just got to make it happen. We finished these couple points, and then our dreams are right there for us to reach and grab. We weren't going to lose. <laughs> we just had to be mentally strong. Like when it was 14 all, you just kind of got to tell yourself it's like being at set zero again, zero to zero, and just play your heart out. <laughs> we had such a, such a um, hard comeback from losing those two games. and. When we got, when they got tied, I was like, we just got to keep pushing. Come on. It's not over yet. And we did a phenomenal job at finishing it. <laughs> <laughs> it's what we work for. That's basically How long have you guys all been playing volleyball together? Oh, oh my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Always. First grade. <laughs> <laughs> I'm back. Well, I'm a newbie. <laughs> yeah, no, you're not I'm a newbie. Yeah. <laughs> but I came close, like, with them. Lish fit in yeah, just she's right. a good fit. Yeah. <laughs> you, you think she's been with us just as long. So the rest of you guys, a lot of you have been playing since like grade school? Yeah. yeah. Bef before. Yeah, before. Yeah. Before. Yeah. 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 When you could walk. Yeah. 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 Before. We remember, yeah. Before, we remember before, watching before you walk. <laughs> when you could first hold a ball. Yeah. <laughs> they would play over clothesline poles. <laughs> they would literally, that's what their net was when they were younger. They would play over a clothesline. This is way better, isn't it? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Coach, you guys didn't lose many sets all season, so when you lose two in a row there, what does it say about your girls to, to rally and, and never give up and, and know the importance of that moment that they needed? They couldn't lose another one. Well, I think it's an awful lot of mental toughness. They're, um, the ability for them to 
number one, not show any kind of emotion and frustration towards their teammates. Yes, they have put forth an effort on and off the court in practice, out of practice, to make each and every one of them accountable, and it makes them even more um, intense in getting the other one to go. Yeah, there's a lot of times during our practices where we're walking off the court, we're showing a little bit of, uh, you know, a little watering in the eyes because somebody might have hit a little bit of a sensitive nerve <laughs> in our body, but it's that sensitive nerve that I think allows these girls and has allowed these girls to really draw and understand that they have the same goal they need to make sure that they can convince them that it's their same goal and if you have everybody convinced that it's the same goal it makes it a heck of a lot easier to to achieve it thank you thank you thank you thank you, thank you guys